That's a bottle flying at cops who responded with pepper spray and made 47 arrests. They threw urine on officers, and that's what caused officers to take action and begin to make arrests. Cops across the country are finding themselves under scrutiny after the shooting of unarmed teenager Michael Brown. But is this guy taking things to the extreme? He's actually using a drone to keep his eye on the police force in Los Angeles. You're not allowed to be in the parking lot. We're not in the parking lot. We're not going to go through, a, you know, a question and answers or semantics. His name is Daniel Salmon, and he and his drone have become public enemy number one to the LAPD. Police behave better when they're being recorded. Salmon is a self-appointed police watchdog who posts videos on his YouTube channel. He flew his drone over the Hollywood police station, capturing video of cops headed out on patrol. They claimed by flying over the parking lot, he was trespassing and ordered him to stop taping. If I went to your home and you were growing something illegally in the backyard, I can't go out the face. Are you guys growing something illegal back there? Salman has already been busted a half dozen times. Cops also reprimanded him for flying a drone over a rally in Los Angeles protesting the shooting in Ferguson. The FAA considers that an aircraft. You cannot fly within 30 miles of uh, the, the Los Angeles airspace. Now, Salma has been temporarily grounded. The L.A. Port Police confiscated one of his $1,400 remote-controlled drones. Are you purposely baiting the police? Are you trying to provoke them? Not at all. I'm not trying to bait the police. I'm just trying to record them, uh, keep an eye on them, and uh, try to monitor their behavior. Salman says nothing will stop him from flying his drone policing the police from above.